Hello everyone, this is Johnny. Welcome to my NASDAQ YouTube channel. In my previous video, I showed you how to install an RDP access Ubuntu desktop in Oracle ARM server. It was working well, but I found that there's no sound coming from remote RDP session to my local machine. So in this video, I'm going to fix that issue. I'm going to show you how to install the sound driver and uh, bring the sound from remote XRDP session to your local computer's speaker. I will make it very simple to show you all only five steps to show you how to do it. So let's Start it. Total, it will be five steps. Create Oracle ARM VM. So Ubuntu VM will be created. Then we're going to install desktop and then RDP and then test RDP using the user and the sec I created in this step. So step one, two, three already presented in previous video. So in this video, I'm going to make it as simple as I can, as fast as I can. Then I'm going to come back at the step four and five with more explanation and the demonstration on those two steps.
Now we have finished our first three step. We can try to see YouTube. There's no sound coming from YouTube, even it can play very well. There's no sound being forward from remote session to the local. So we can fix it by running a script, which is hosting on a 51 sec repository site at GitHub. So if you want to see what is running in there, you can see all the command and the configuration. So let's using this script and install a sound driver and make the configuration changes, fix the no sound issue. And then we test it again. So we're gonna turn it off. We're gonna go back to our session. So we can copy the whole command, just one command, and then it can be automatically configure this sound support for your Ubuntu 20 or for on your ARM server. It won't take too long to be completed. Um, so we're gonna just let it running. Okay, the script has been completed. As you can see, the output shows installed term and there's a new user has been created, RDB user, RDB user underscore password. We can use that to log into Valify as well. You also can use in the second user. So let's give it a try. I'm going to continue to use the previous account I created. Looks like the previous session doesn't work. Let's try it again. This time I'm going to use an RDP user. Now it looks fine. One thing I want to check is uh, sound device setting. So now you can see output device as XRDP sync, input device XRP source. 
Netscape will try to see if we can get sound from this RDP session. Yes, as you can hear, I'm not sure if you can hear the background sound, it's playing. The sound forwarding from the remote side coming to the, my local speakers pretty well. Not perfect, but it works at this moment. I'm happy with it. So that is the solution how you can bring your remote XRDP's sound into your local speaker. Just running a, running a script using this command, you can easily configure your sound support on your Ubuntu ARM machine. I hope you like this video. If you find this video has some interesting stuff and useful information, please give me a thumb up. Also, if you haven't subscribed my channel, please do. Thank you for watching. See you in my next episode.